We all love classics, but classics are things that endure. Whether we're talking about a vintage Chevy truck, or in this case, the Springfield MC operator. John Browning would be proud because this is the latest version of the 1911 that's been around over 100 years, designed specifically for the Marine Corps, and it's a badass pistol. Stick around, because we're gonna run this thing through its paces, and you're gonna see just how cool a pistol this really is. Welcome to Shooter the Series, and uh, we're really happy to be back here at the Mystery Range today, which is kind of down on the farm. And it's a beautiful day up here, it's quiet, it's tranquil, and we're going to fix that pretty soon. Uh, today, we're, we're lucky enough to have the Springfield MC operator, and just like we always do, we want to show safe and clear. We can have a nice little conversation, no big surprises, no bad things are going to happen. Now, this is the MC operator and this is made by Springfield Armory. And this is a classic John Browning um, design 1911. Like I said earlier, it's over 100 years old and designed, but it's been upgraded to the 21st century to really make the most of new technology as well as classic technology. And this is actually was designed, you know, it's called the MC because it was designed for uh, Marine Corps Rapid Deployment Forces that were operating in the fleet. And it's, it's an all metal gun. It's got a forged steel uh, frame and a forged steel slide. And it's covered with a, a real nice uh, uh, Cerakoted uh, green frame. Uh, just to talk about some of the features that are very common with all 1911s is, you know, the fact that it's got the grip safety at the back. It also has, you know, some texture, some checkering back on the mainspring housing. It also comes with uh, ambidextrous safety, right or left. So if you're a righty or a lefty, you're still good. It also has what's known as a skeletonized hammer, a little bit lightweight. And it also comes with, you know, a low profile. These are Trigicon um, tritium sights that are great for low light or even in the dark. And it also comes uh, straight from the factory with wraparound Packmeyer rubber grips. And I've always been a fan of the, the Packmeyer grips because they're grippy, a little bit soft, and they help soak up a little bit of a recoil. Um, this also, uh, one of the things worth mentioning is uh, unlike a lot of 1911s, this comes with an attachment rail right here. And this allows you to attach like a tactical light or a laser setup. Um, something like that is usually something you have to have added on later by a gunsmith. And this is actually incorporated into the design. It comes with serrations at the rear of the slide as well as at the front of the slide. Now, it comes with a forged match grade barrel and um, they kept this one simple. This basically has a standard GI type spring which is, you know, enclosed inside and uh, this thing is just meant to operate and just run and run and run. It's, uh, there, there are different, you know, levels of quality pistol that are available. And I've lost count of all the different uh, manufacturers making 1911s, but I'm a huge fan of Springfield Armory. And that's because they stick with the standard Colt pattern, which means they have the Colt pattern parts for interchangeability meaning you can get parts, if you can get Colt parts, they'll just drop right into this. Whereas, you know, you're gonna have some other guns like say the SIG or the Kimber that have proprietary parts, um, you're gonna have a much easier time when it comes if you need replacements uh, in a pinch, being able to just get Colt pattern parts. And uh, I'm a huge fan of interchangeability and availability. And uh, when it comes to supply chains, I want them as short as possible. So this is a great pistol. Um, 
And I would say that, you know, in the scale between um, production pistols and custom pistols, this is at the very highest end of production pistols. And I would probably put this in as a premium production pistol. And um, it's built tight, it's meant to shoot straight. And uh, if price was no object and I was looking for another 1911, this would be the one. So you can't go wrong with a Springfield Armory. And uh, in a few minutes, we're gonna go run some rounds through it. And uh, I hope you enjoy it as much as I do. Now for the fun part. That was fun. The only thing better than one mag of 45s would be two. Oops. It happens. We're safe, we're clear. And if you were here, you'd be having almost as much fun as me. Springfield MC Operator, when you care to send the very best. On behalf of Shoot of the Series, if you really like this video, be sure to hit the like, the share, and the subscribe, because it will really help us out. And we can't wait to see you next time. Y'all take care.